going on everybody welcome back because we're back here with the dolphins fence jack franchise on madden nfl 18 on xbox one so guys yeah it's been a while because last time was on our bye week so yeah it's a it, it's been quite a while that is for sure <coughs> so yeah it's a it's getting pretty intense now as we're getting closer towards the end of the season we're now at week 12 we're going to be taking on our boys, the New England Patriots, who do not have Tom Brady now. So, uh, who exactly is your quarterback? I feel like I know who it is. But, uh, if not, we'll just find out. So, yeah, we finally have the number one ranked defense now, which is good. Our offense is 24th in the land. <clears throat> as well as we also hold the best defense. So, weekly awards. Really didn't miss anything at all. <coughs> For sure. But, uh, yeah, we're getting about that time. We're getting about ready to roll here. So we're going to be taking on the Patriots. This is the last week that Connor Cook will be the starter as next week. Carson Palmer will be returning to the lineup, which is really good. Oh, their starting quarterback is hurt. They have Mike Glennon. So their top offensive weapon is Greg Olson. Top defensive weapon is Zach Brown. <laughs> so this is the backup. This, this, is the, this will be the battle of backup quarterbacks here. Ooh, this might be a little fun. We're about the 86 overall, so this this could be could be a pretty even matchup right here. <laughs> hey, we're both in this with backup quarterbacks. We get ours next week. We get our starting quarterback net back next week. It'll be his first game since week four against New Orleans. <laughs> <coughs> We've been in a group here since for this slight playthrough. <coughs> okay, so we have a one game lead over Kansas City and Houston for the number one seed in the AFC. The funny thing is, week 16, we actually have to play Kansas City. So, right now, that's, that's going to be that's gonna be a pretty big game. Yo, they're wearing the alternate jerseys. Dude, we're getting like all the luck here. We can <laughs> In the alternate jerseys. Dude, this is so cool. Holy crap, bro. We got to see the Falcons in alternate jerseys. We got to see the Chargers alternate. This is the first time I've actually seen, <coughs> seen the Patriots in alternate jerseys. We need, you know what? Next video, we're, 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 we're going to be wearing our alternate jerseys. You know what? That's what we're going to do. We're going to be wearing our alternate jerseys in the next video, if I remember. I'm, I'm going to make sure to put that down. That's what, okay, it's third and two of the 18, so, um, yeah, I'm going to have to put that down. We're going to be wearing, like, the Dolphins have, like, their old, thro or, like, retro throwback jerseys, which they wore, like, three times in 2018. Oh, my gosh. I had no idea what was going on. Oh, it's Kiko Alonzo. <laughs> well, that play did not go well at all. That is for sure. It's raining, of course, you know, in real life. Or 2015, it was Xavier Howard, you know. Of course, you know, in case you haven't heard, the Dolphins officially gave Xavier Howard <coughs> his contract extension five years, 76 million, I think like 53 something guaranteed. He's not the highest paid quarter in the NFL, barely, just enough ahead of you know Josh Norman. It's like, you know, you're asking, is, is he worth it? Absolutely, of course. People say he's a one hit wonder. Well, we'll find out. Also, I don't care, remember, it's our first game with Taylor Gabriel back. If it is, oh, dang, I think we're in. Oh, wait, it was first. I thought it was third down. Second and in inches here. All right. Yo, all right, yeah, we got to throw, like, wear our throwback jerseys next year. We're playing Denver next, so. Heck, yeah, we got to we gotta, we gotta throw on our throwback, you know. If they're going to be doing this, then obviously we need to be able to do it, too. You feel me? 
Side of my like chest is killing me right now, huh? I'm not exactly sure if that's a good thing or a bad. There's like a shooting pain. Well, the good news is, you know, like I know, obviously it's not a heart attack because, from what I heard, you know, if you have a heart attack, it, it's it's your left arm that hurts. Like it's just like you just like numb, which it does not hurt. What the? <coughs> that's really cool. Ow, frick! Oh, that hurts. Jeez, I'm like in bad shape right now. I'm not doing too good right now, guys. <clears throat> I'm not just getting sick. Six days till graduation. Come on, boys. I'll take it off. I'll take it off. Take it off. Go, 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 go. Ah! Touchdown. There we go. boy, Connor. I said, Geet, let me just go ahead and die for this right quick. Alright, 10 7. Two minute drill. Time to get some points. Right, we need Buffalo to win. Yeah, New England's like two games behind us. They're 7 and 3. I don't remember if they were like in possession of a wild card spot or not. What are you saying? That is weird. It kind of freaks me out. He's like, keep going, Lonzo. We only lost two yards, but, yeah, that's the second sack of the game. So we got to worry about, you know, the former Dolphin and, you know, this. So, uh, yeah, we – all right, so we can hit – or, no. What the heck? Come on, Zach. She'll said like, one of the surest hands for a tight end. So you, you're now teammate Zach Brown. <coughs> So yeah, we're gonna try this little play here and see if it works. If it does, it does. If it doesn't, it doesn't. You know, obviously, if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Yeah, not enough for a first down and uh, injury timeout, and it's for New England. So let's see if we can. It's a good one. Oh, what the heck was that? Yo, what the frick? Oh my gosh, she just like embarrassed like half my special team unit. Nice job, noobs. <coughs> oh, they're getting down the field. Third and four here. What the? Oh, oh my gosh, Johnny Hacker, look at him, he's on the field. What the frick? What the? Okay, the defense is playing against you. CJ Mosley is lined up. What the? Oh my god, dude. It's defense against defense. No, it's defense against special teams. Dude, you see that? that CJ Mosley was a running back. He tried to throw the ball to Kiko Alonso. Dude, this is like the coolest crap I think I've ever seen in my life. I'm not going to lie. This was pretty freaking cool. Dude, that was super cool. Not even gonna lie. Who was it that broke up that pass? So, wait, who was it for them that threw the ball? Can we see? Uh, game stats. Player stats. That was JT Thomas. Left outside linebacker. Never heard of him, actually. Right, second and five on this. Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. How did you drop that? Come on, Zach. You, you let me down right now. Alright, you're like, you're supposed to be my game breaking tight end, dude. You're legit, like, you are legit just about, you are our best offensive play. You're our best offensive player that does not play a line, alright? Okay, Juju caught it. I don't think I'm gonna call it. This is gonna say fourth and inch. Oh, first down, let's go. That's exactly what we needed right there. All right, and just enough for the first down. That's for sure. Yeah. 
Man, these guys are like a whole bunch of like Dolphins players. Like I just saw Lawrence say, "Well, he's not a Dolphins player anymore. Uh, he, he was before. Like he became a free agent after the 2017 season. Does not have a new team, so you know either he is going to get one, or you know he's basically just like one of those guys that says, "All right, I guess my time in the NFL is over." Oh, come on, Shark Tank. You got to beat that. You get stuffed at the line here. It's a big game right here, bro. We got to win this. So, come on, man. We got to win this game. This is a big one. Like, 9-1. They're 8-3. and three. We got to keep ahead if we want to get that number one seed, boy. Could be crucial. Down the road. Could be crucial. Oh, shoot. Ah, cannot get away from that one. zone struggles one thing you don't need on a team is to struggle in the red zone <coughs> ah. uh, Jameis Winston's booty who is that oh it's Dion Lewis so we rank third in turnovers for so we don't have a single one today. That is very uncharacteristic of our defense. Ah, oh, dang it. <coughs> Come on, man. We, man we, we can't keep getting owned by these boys now. First, say, come on, Miami. Are you, aren't you guys sick and tired of being owned by a new... Okay, first off, who is our quarterback? Can we see on this play? Who is their... Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot. What? Darius Slay sprained his ACL. What? Connor Cook sprained it. Oh, my God. We just lost our best quarter. We just lost our backup quarterback. That is horrible. <coughs> but, yeah, but these two are gone. We just lost our best corner. Oh, yeah, I forgot. They have Odell and they have Big Ben, so... Good news is we don't have to worry about either one of them. Holy crap. That, that would have been horrible. But the bad news is we are in some serious troubles. We're down to our third string quarterback and our number one corner is out. But hey, we got we got Jimmy Smith. We got Jimmy Smith. I don't remember who our, our other corner was. Like, technically, technically, who is our nickel corner? Can we see? Depth chart. Uh, Daryl Worley, who had the, the game ceiling pick against Carolina. So I'm not feeling too bad. <clears throat> All right, we got less than five minutes to go here. We got to get a touchdown here. We'll get one, and we don't turn the ball over. I'm gonna go front on fourth down. Oh, what the frick! Oh, well, that's what I get for a third string quarterback, obviously. Quite like you doing something. You ain't doing. Something. <laughs> All right, so somebody's gotta come up here now. Yes, sir, Lamar Miller. <coughs> Twenty to seventeen. Oh, we got the ball back. Oh, we get we forced a turnover. Don't think I should be probably running my, my key play with it because I need a quarterback to throw it, and we're down to Luke McCown now. So obviously. <clears throat> yep. Who is that? He's just hauling ass down the field. <clears throat> hey, dummy, the game ain't over yet. We still got a whole 245 to go. Oh, you caught, you caught that one. Where was the other one? <clears throat> we have 400. That just put us over 400 yards of offense. I'm feeling pretty good. All right, so we're going to risk it here. We're going to try to run the football, obviously. It might be. Depends. Yeah, it was the biggest play for them because he just got his ass lit up. All right, so what do we do? What is the field goal options? Okay, obviously the game is telling us the punt, so. I think we'd probably be wise to listen to the game and watch this. Okay, I was about to say, if you tell us to go for a field goal now, I'm about to just go, ha ha, you're crazy. All right, we got to try to pin these boys deep right here. We got to try something here. Just put them back as far as we can. 
to the seven. There we go. <coughs> <coughs> Game is on the line. We gotta make a stop here. We have 156 to try to end this bad boy and get out and escape New England with a win. Something that the Dolphins rarely do. Period. In New England. Oh, DJ, you should have dove over and got that one. That probably might have sealed the deal. <coughs> okay, I still have my thing. I like to call my snot towel. Save, save the first down right there. Was that Jimmy Smith? I think that was Jimmy Smith. They just got over 300 yards of offense. Uh, we can't let him get out of bounds now. <coughs> Pretty competitive game, regardless who wins. It's been a pretty good game. Of course, you know, obviously I prefer we win the game, but you know. Oh my god, how did I miss? <clears throat> I was like, somebody get him. I was like, I don't care. Somebody just get him. Just somebody just try to get him. Incomplete. Nice pass break up. The Deion Jones. Debo. <clears throat> third and 13. Last time we had a third long this scenario. We got to just get a game inning pick. I wish we'd do the same thing here. Alright, game's on the line, guys. Game is on the line. Fourth and 11. This is it. We can end it right here. 61 seconds. We can end this now. Oh, Devo. Nice pass breakup. It could be more satisfying with a pick, but we'll take it. Well, it ain't over yet. This has got two timeouts, so we know they, they're obviously going to try to hit stick us now, so. So, you know, we ain't, we, we ain't out of the woods just yet now. Oh, go. Ah, look, he broke a tackle. That's ball game. Gotta be. Freaking, he just broke away from a tackle and just gone. <coughs> Dale, yeah. Look at this, man. Watch this. Escapes this tackle. Gets a block. From Zach Ertz, and he's just gone. I thought Zach Brown was going to He's on catches. He didn't catch us. This is awesome. Well, there we go, guys. This is Baldy. He managed to hold on and get the victory. <laughs> the big win right there. We actually managed to head into Gillette Stadium and, you know, be a Dolphins team that not too many. Not too many Dolphins teams have done these this past 20 years, and that's go into Foxborough and steal a victory. I think the last one was either 20, I think it was like 2014, 2015 when the Dolphins opened the season. I, at the, I believe it was 2014 when Miami went into Gillette Sam, and they actually pulled off the upset. You know, they still didn't make the playoffs, obviously. <laughs> So obviously we got to look at our stats here. So Connor Cook 
Went 14 for 22 for 164 yards, left the game with an injury. Luke McCow, 4 for 6, 62 yards, one touchdown. <clears throat> Just <clears throat> blow my nose. So Lamar Miller, 22 care, 22 rushes, 133 yards and a touchdown. Tricandrick West, two rushes for five yards. Luke McCown, two rushes for negative two yards. And Connor Cook, two rushes for 10 yards and a touchdown. Receiving wise, Zach Ertz, five receptions for 61 yards. Another you know, Gabriel, his first game back from injury, four receptions for 58 yards. Juju, <coughs> four receptions. 440 yards, Lamar Miller, two receptions for 16 yards, as well as the go-ahead touchdown. Both of them, really, the receiving and the running rushing touchdown. Zay Jones, two receptions for 45 yards. And Ricky Seals Jones, one reception for six yards. And then all this other blocking crap right here. And Justin Tucker was two for two and a long 43. Johnny Hecker. Four punts for 187 yards, and both these guys have like the turns. Don't know if like even all this other you know, crap out right here. But yeah, there we go, guys. Head into New England and get ourselves a victory. This is a big one. Should I upgrade our So our top offensive earners were Connor Cook, Juju Smith-Schuster, Taylor Gabriel, Zach Ertz, and Lamar Miller. Our top defensive earners were Jimmy Smith, Darius Slay, Johnny Hecker, Deion Jones, and Justin Tucker. So both of our kickers got <coughs> quite a bit. Oh, oh wait, was is he not hurt? He's not hurt. He's not hurt. Darius Slay's not hurt. I thought for sure he said he sprained his ACL. I was like, okay, he's obviously going to miss some time. I guess not. I guess not. I ain't complaining. Not one freaking bit am I complaining at all. Not at all, bro. That is like, I am ecstatic because that Connor Cook is not hurt either. That could be his last start, but he did a great job right there. So we now head off. Ready to sim here to week 13 as we're getting closer and closer to the end. As we are 10 and 1, baby. <clears throat> 10 and 1 right now. I'm pretty sure we obviously still have leg up on the competition. Hopefully, Buffalo beat Kansas City. And you know, hopefully, you know, Texans lost because that's who we're going to be. So, we're going to be going up against a Broncos team that's 4 and 7 and not really in playoff contention. <laughs> You see this guys Carson Palmer is finally back the old grizzled veteran who basically had the shit beat out of him his entire NFL career is finally back since we lost him against New Orleans in garbage time which I knew I should have replaced him but anyways guys we're getting there I think they did win <coughs> so anyways guys we're getting closer close to the end of this let's play uh, I think I need to hit the team schedule Yes, so yeah, we've had pretty interesting games so far. So we have, we're at home against the Broncos. We have the Patriots coming in for Monday Night Football. We hit the road to play the Bills. We have to play the Chiefs, which I could still be huge. And then we finish up at home against the Bills. So let's see, have we clinched a playoff spot now? Let's. I would like to check the standings, please. Uh, no, we have not actually. We've still not. Nobody has. <coughs> like we win this one, we will. But we will just have to wait and see. As that is going to go ahead and wrap it up for this video. So, anyways, managed to pull up a ten-point victory against the Patriots in New England. And anyways, guys.
Carson Palmer is back, and we will see him in action in the next episode of the Madden 18 Dolphins Fantasy Draft franchise. Until then, I will see you all then. Peace out, guys.